were four to ahead, but Stephen Pienaar came up with the final equaliser, which means joy for Everton, despair for United. Manchester United four, Everton four. Unbelievable, and look at the, the disbelief at Old Trafford, the players, the fans as well, I imagine. It looked like they were cruising eight points clear. It's finished 4 4. The gap is six. Your reaction, Gary Neville? Well, talk about making things difficult for yourself. Conceding four goals at home. You've got to give massive credit to Everton. They were a threat all afternoon. And at 3 1 at 4 2, Manchester United did not close that game out. They had the experience to close that game out and they didn't do it. What's the game, Greg? Fantastic. I think you have to give Everton great credit. You know, they started the game well, got the front foot. Best team in the first half. For Man United. They find themselves one down. They haul themselves into a great position. 4-2 up. And they're blowing it. They're blowing it. And right now, the momentum is now with City because they'll be feeling sorry and angry. The United player. Well, I mean, it's, it's so much better to everything here today. You know, there's a whole attitude from the first kickoff. They, they put two players up front. Bellini, what a, what a performance he had today. He was at the heart of everything good about Everton's entire play. And I think, you know, as a team, you know, they, 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 I think they caught Man United a little bit by surprise today. You know, Man United didn't start well. Even though they did get themselves in front, once again they kept coming and they kept trying. And it was as good a game as I've seen in a long time. Faces at all. I don't think they can believe what they've seen, the United fans. Well, this is what it means to be top of the Barclays Premier League. Incredible. Just touch on Everton, who stay in seven, too clear of Liverpool, who can go ahead of them with a win against West Brom, a game that kicks off at four o'clock. As do City, knowing that they can close the gap now to three points. It's back in their hands. Win this afternoon, then win at the Etihad, and they will be top. So this is what they've got to do first. They need to beat Wolves. Wolves have got to win Terry Connor's side, or they'll be down. All to play for next in live from Molyneux, a game not to miss. And then, as I'm sure as, as you're aware, it's Manchester City against Manchester United. What a night this is going to be on the Monday Night Football. Week on Monday, 7 o'clock, high definition, Sky 3D. Wow. Before all of that, lot to look back on with Graham Nile and Gary after the most incredible game at Old Trafford. Six sensational goals in the second half. It finished 4-4. We will look back when we return.